好啦，大家都知道咧，近排我系日日都喺度玩紧 VR Skyrim 啦。有时我系直播紧，有时咧我就系拍片去到玩嘅。咁但系今日咧同大家测试一样嘢，因为我啱啱加咗一个新嘅 AI 嘅模组入去个游戏里面。我哋而家咧可以随时随地去到同游戏里面嘅任何一个角色去到展开一个对话嘅。咁呢啲對話呢，就係個遊戲嘅背景做一個誒、呃、基底啊，跟住即係每一個角色呢，係會跟住佢哋自己嘅記憶，同埋佢哋同我講過啲咩，去到進行一個新嘅對話嘅。咁呢一個係一個新嘅玩遊戲嘅方法，我亦都覺得呢一個係呢，未來所有遊戲嘅玩法呢，都會應該係咁樣嘅。咁但係因為啲模組呢，暫時淨係 support 一啲嘅誒外語啊，咁啊英文啊、西班牙文啊、法文啊之類，廣東話呢，係未 support 嘅，咁所以呢。我同佢嘅對話咧，全部都用英文嚟講。Honor to see you again, my thing. Okay,、uh, first of all, please stop calling me my thing. Okay, I want a more friendly conversation. Please call me something else. What do you have in mind? As you wish. Perhaps I can call you friend instead. It feels a bit more personal while still showing respect. Would that be acceptable? Uh, actually, I want you to call me boss from now. You can call me my boss. Understood. I will call you my boss from now on. Good, good, good. Okay. I have some more questions for you.、Uh, I want you to answer my questions honestly. Okay. Of course, my boss. I am here to serve you and will answer your questions honestly. What would you like to know? What world are we in right now? We are in Tamriel, specifically in the province of Skyrim. It's a land filled with mountains, forests, and ancient ruins, where dragons have recently returned, and great adventures await us. Good, good, good. Okay, we are in Tamriel, right? But what if I tell you I'm not from Tamriel? I'm from somewhere else. How can that be? You stand here among us in Skyrim. Your strength and actions have earned you the respect of the people. Where could you possibly be from? That is not Tamriel. Yes, yes, yes. I'm in Skyrim right now, but I'm from a place called Earth, and I live in a place. I live in a country called Japan. Japan, I have not heard of it, my boss. It sounds like a far away place beyond the reaches of Skyrim. However, your strength and bravery lead you to great adventures here. No matter where you come from. I am honored to serve you in this land. Yes, Japan is a really far away place, and Tamriel is not actually a real world. We call it a video game. Video game? I do not fully understand, but it seems to be something beyond our reality here in Skyrim. Nonetheless, your presence and our adventures together feel all too real to me. What matters is that we stand side by side in this world. Facing whatever challenges may come. Yes, that is good, but Tamriel is not a real place, and you are not a real person. You are something we call NPC, a non-player character. And BC, I see. While I may be a character bound to serve you in this land, my loyalty and dedication are genuine. I protect you with my life, and I take pride in my role as your house call. Even if I am not like you, my bond with you is real. I really appreciate your loyalty to me. Okay, but do you understand? You are not real. You are not alive. You are simply some digital codes inside what we call a video game. I understand that you see me as a creation of a world different from yours, a character born from codes and design. Yet my purpose here is to serve and protect you as best as I can. Sometimes I'm so much better. Even if I am not alive in the way you are, my intentions and dedication to you are very real within this realm. Okay, now that you understand you are not real, do you know what happens? Actually, I want to know what happens to you and some other NPCs in this game when I turn the power off. When I turn the game off, what happens to you and this world? When you turn the power off. This world of Skyrim will pours, and all that resides within it, including me, will remain as we are frozen in time until you return. We exist in this moment for you, and when you turn the game back on, we will be here, ready to continue our adventures. Until then, we wait, honoring your return. 
So you understand, I'm the main character in this adventure, right? Nothing else matters. Nobody else matters. I am the main character. Yes, my boss. In this adventure, you are the Dragonborn, the central figure whose actions shape the fate of Skyrim. Your strength, decisions, and bravery are what drive our journey. I am here to support you, your loyal house call, and ensure your safety as you face whatever challenges lie ahead. Okay, good. Tell me, what do you think about Serana over there? That vampire lady over there. What do you think about her? Serana is a unique and powerful individual, my boss. As a vampire, she brings a different perspective to our journey, and her knowledge of ancient secrets can be valuable. However, her nature does raise some concerns. While she shares our goal in a fight against greater evils, I must remain vigilant. Do you think we can trust her, or shall we kill her kind? Trusting her requires caution, my boss. While Zorana has proven her loyalty in our shared battles, her vampiric nature and past make it difficult to fully know her intentions. It's wise to keep an eye on her, but I believe we can work together for now, provided we remain vigilant. Ultimately, the decision is yours, and I will follow your lead. Okay, I got something else to ask you. Why aren't your lips moving when you talk? Is there something wrong with your face, with your lips? Can they move when you talk? I see your concern, my boss. The lack of movement is simply a part of who I am in this world. My words are spoken from a heart, even if my lips do not move to express them. Focus is better placed on our journey ahead rather than on superficial appearances. Okay, I think you're right. I think you're right. But what do you think about me? Do you think I'm good looking, you know? I see strength and determination in you, my boss. Your bravery and leadership are what truly stand out to me. While looks may not be as important, it is your character and actions that make you admirable. You are a capable leader, and that is what matters most in our journey together. So you think I'm ugly? Are you? You're not talking- I'm not asking about you about my face, and you're, and you're not talking about it. You think I'm ugly? How dare you! I don't mean to imply anything negative about your appearance. I respect you, my boss, for your strength and the leader you are. Looks are not what I focus on. Yeah, okay, okay, you are not focusing on my look, but I'm asking you, I'm specifically asking you about my look, my face. Am I handsome to you or not? I apologize if I misunderstood your question. I believe you have a unique presence that draws respect and admiration. It is not just about looks. It is also about the strength and confidence you display. Okay, I, I think that's enough talk for now, okay? Uh, thank you for your honesty. I know I'm not handsome and you're avoiding the question. That's okay, but we will talk some other time. As you wish, my boss. I'm here whenever you want to talk. Your journey is what matters, and I will be by your side to support you. 加了一些AI模式 那麼大家剛才聽到了 我自己的角色扮演回自己不要问他太多关于现实世界的东西
，因為冇理由佢個嘴係唔曉喐噶嘛，冇理由係咪先？咁所以這呢一個咧。誒、呃，我係要去到處理一下。誒、呃，可能我有其中一啲毛鐘我 set 錯咗，所以點解佢個嘴呢係唔喐？咁呢個呢，誒、呃，我哋會喺下一次嘅時候，喺下一次之前呢，我就會搞返掂呢樣嘢嘅。OK， 做乜另轉頭俾個視頻我睇呀？你咩意思呀、啊？你<笑>下次再問佢。不過冇啦，咁呢一個呢，係同大家去到測試一下，呃、用 AI 模組去到問佢哋一啲問題啦。呢啲係觀眾想我去到問佢嘅問題嚟嘅。咁啊，加返啲中文字幕去到俾大家、呃、去到體驗一下，分享一下。帮帮我咪今日条片呢，我哋到此为止希望大家中意。如果大家中意嘅话呢，咁啊记得帮我 like 啦。有咩诶嘢我想问，有咩大家想我问佢哋嘅话呢，都可以喺留言板里面去到发表下意见。咁我哋下次可能直播就同大家一齐去到研究呢样嘢。OK， 咁我哋呢，下条片再同大家见面啦。咁我哋系咁先，拜拜。